Johnny over the top. And onside, Arena Tom! Hey everyone, welcome to Anatomy of a Goal on MLSsoccer.com. I'm Greg Lawless. In this episode, we look at Jairo Arrieta's goal for the Columbus crew in a dramatic 4-3 win over the New England Revolution on Saturday, August 25th, 2012. It's a goal created by quick ball movement in the midfield that both sets up and takes advantage of confusion in the defense. Let's wind it back and break it down. The play starts with a throw in on the left side. The most important thing to notice at this point is that the Revolution are marked up man to man across the back because the crew are pressing for the winner at home. Now the marking is tight enough, but late in a tied game on the road, no defense wants to be in a man to man situation. In addition, the Revs midfielder Lee Wynn, who subbed in for the more defensive minded Clyde Sims, has drifted out of the middle, leaving Milovan Mirosevic alone in space. So naturally, Josh Williams throws the ball into Morosevic, and that sets the clockworks in motion. To begin with, the Reds' Ryan Guy must leave his man to pressure the ball. Now Morosevic recognizes what's happened, and without taking a touch, heads the ball on to the suddenly open Tony Chani. The Revs are really exposed at this point. Center back Stephen McCarthy is particularly between a rock and a hard place. What should he do? Should he go to the ball, or should he stay with his man? He takes a tiny stutter step in the direction of Chani because he's not really sure what to do. And that's the fateful moment. Because that little freeze gives Arietta the fraction of opportunity he needs. He is moving and pointing long before the ball gets to Chani. So Chani's one-time ball is perfectly weighted and Arietta slams home the volley with poise and grace. It's as if scoring the winner on this night was Arietta's destiny. And maybe it was. After all, it was his birthday and his family was within kissing distance. Well, that's it for this episode of Anatomy of a Goal. Join me again next week and we'll wind it back and break it down. Johnny over the top. And onside, Arena Top!